Hey guys, welcome back. So today's destination is Memphis, Tennessee, home of the blues music and the birthplace of rock and roll. So let's get out there and explore the city. Let's go. So on the first stop would be Memorial of Elvis Presley, the king of rock and roll. Let's check it out. guys did you know that Elvis Presley the king of rock and roll has a house here in Memphis Tennessee named Graceland it's about 15 minutes away from Beale Street and it turned that mansion or the house into a museum and every now and then there's a show that plays for the people who visit the museum or his house. Alright guys, so Bill Street, Memphis is one of the historic place here in Memphis, Tennessee. This is the home of the blues music. the Congress officially named Bill Street here in Memphis officially the home of blues music So Beale Street host a music festival during May which features rock and roll, jazz, country and blues music. In front of FedEx Forum, the home of the Memphis Grizzlies. And congrats to them, they're on the playoffs now. And did you know that Justin Timberlake is a minority owner of Memphis Grizzlies? He was also born and raised here in Memphis, Tennessee. Do you know why the Memphis Grizzlies? stadium is called FedEx Forum because since 1977 FedEx headquarters is located here in Memphis, Tennessee. Martin Luther King Jr. was murdered back in 1968 and now this motel is actually a museum Guys, 
Memphis, Tennessee is also known of their barbecue. So right now, we are on the hunt of a good barbecue place. So, let's go. Okay guys, so no restaurant is open yet. It's still early. It's only about 10.30, so most of the restaurants open at 11 o'clock. So, we'll kind of wait and still walk around and check some spots out here. So guys, right now we are in front of the AutoZone Park. It's in front of our hotel. This is the home of their minor league baseball team, which is the Memphis Redbirds. So right now we are here in San Studio. This is where Elvis Presley recorded his first ever album. So guys, did you know how Elvis Presley started his career? So back in the summer of 1950s, San Studios would let any passerby record any album. So his first ever album was for his mom. For her birthday but the owner Sam Phillips was unimpressed of what he recorded but his secretary heard something that she liked so she invited Elvis Presley to come back and record another song titled called that's all right and that's how Elvis Presley started his career so when i was ordering the server said when you're in the south you need to get big and also she said you're gonna get your sweet in here because mostly the food that they serve are mainly sweet so now I have my food let's get ready to dig in Alright guys, so that's it for Memphis, Tennessee. Hope you guys enjoyed it. That, wait, that half of a rack of ribs was so delicious. I can't even talk straight right now. But anyway, I'll see you guys on our next stop.